Hey, this is Minute Man 20 here today, and I'm just doing a uh, captive care on Emperor Scorpions. And um, my overall opinion is they make great pets first and foremost, uh, especially for a novice keeper. Um, their venom is very uh, non-potent. Um, they hardly ever sting or even attempt to sting. Um, it's recommended not to hold them though. It can stress out the animal and. Uh, it's a bad thing, you know, if you do get stung. It ain't real bad. It's just like a bee sting, but nobody wants that. But I pick mine up quite a bit, but I just scoop them up. Just like so. Keep them close to the ground. Make sure you don't drop them, because that ain't good on them. There he goes. But, uh, I've been keeping scorpions for about ten years now. And, um, these are one of my favorite, uh, favorite scorpion species. Um, they are the second largest species of scorpion in the world. They are from the tropical forest of Africa. Uh, so it's nice to have this nice blended, uh, it's called an eco blend from Zoomed is what I use. Um, looks like that right there is the bag it comes in. You can get that in just about any pet store. But uh, they eat live food like crickets and mealworms and uh, large ones we even eat pinky mice. Um, it's said it's best not to keep food in there 24-7 because the food can bite the scorpion. I've never had any problems with that. I keep food in there pretty much 24-7. Um, you can feed them about two to three times a week as normal if you don't keep food in there all the time. If you're going to feed them like mealworms you want to not hand feed them but use little tongs, little uh, uh, hemostats is what they're called. Um, they use them in the medical field, but you can buy them at Farm and Home or, you know, uh, places like that, possibly Walmart. Um, they're good eaters. Uh, they're really easy to keep. Uh, a lot of people, water-wise, use like the cricket gel stuff for them to drink. I just spray mine down, try to keep the humidity up and everything. Do not use a water dish. They can drown. Um, but uh, I think one of the coolest parts of scorpions is you never want to use a heat lamp on them just because they have that exoskeleton and they're nocturnal. You want some good hides that they can get underneath. Uh, temperature wise keep them about 75 to 82 degrees which is about perfect because normal house is about 75 degrees. But I think awesome thing about them is if I turn off this light, I grab my black light, all scorpions glow. And you can't really tell from the video. No, you can't tell at all. They're blowing a grow, yeah, glowing a bright green. And it's very neat. So if you have them, it's, it's great to get a black light to check that out. Um, but yeah, overall wise, they're really easy to care for. They're good eaters. They're awesome little critters. They're pretty calm. A lot of people pick them up by the tail. I don't believe in that. That I don't know. It just looks painful to me, and you can't really ask them if it hurts. So why do it? But uh, so spray them down. Keep them well fed. And you'll have some awesome pets to come. Hope you all enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, leave it on the comments, and I'll get right back to you. Have a good one, Spin Man 20.